Hi guys, so today I'll be testing the product failure between a polythene high quality carrier bag and a reused recycled paper bag. And I'll also be testing, I'll also be doing a tensile test of these two products. So guys, as you can see, I have my high quality plastic carrier bag here. And what I will be doing is I will be loading it with five kilograms each time and letting it sit for a minute on an elevated surface so that I can see when the uh, bag fails. As you can see, I've got the five kilo in the bag and now I will be putting it on this hook here and letting it dangle or hang and I will test it for a minute. And there's my time. So there it is, the bag hanging. And now I will let it go and stop my stopwatch. There you go, it started. Now I'll wait for the minute to finish and I'll get back to it. And to see if it breaks with five kilos within a minute. Okay guys, the minute's over now. Now I'm gonna put the 10 kilo in and then measure it again. All right, now I've got 10 kilos in the bag and now I lift it up again and start the minute right, now I'm starting the minute for 10 kilograms there we go So this will all happen throughout the test until the product fails. There's now 15 kilos in the bag and now just waiting for the minute to finish. As you can see there's 20 kilos in the bag now and the bag is starting to... It's still holding the weight but I don't think it will hold much more. Just waiting for the minute to finish. Right guys, so I had 25 kilos in the bag and as soon as I put it on the hook the bag failed so the bag's maximum load is 25 kilos so guys the high quality plastic carrier bag has failed so now I'm gonna test the recycled paper bag and as you can see I've got five kilos in there and I'm gonna do the same timing a minute long so the paper bag is on the hook now I'm gonna let go and stop my timer There we go, the bag is free and just waiting to see if it fails in a minute. Now, the 10 kilos is in the bag, putting it on the hook. And I'm gonna let go as soon as I hit the start button from the timer. There we go, it's stopping. That's now 15 kilos in the bag and the timer has already started. Right guys, I've got 20 kilos in the bag. I'm just gonna let go. And it's still holding. As you can see, the bag only had 20 kilos in and it has ripped. As you can see, the paper bag ripped closer to the bottom and the plastic high quality bag ripped at the handle. So guys, now, I am about to do a tensile test on um, a strip of the recycled paper bag and also on a strip of a plastic carrier bag. I'm going to do the test first and this is how the setup will be. And right now the setup is weighing 300 grams but as I add more weight on we'll go on from there. So guys, now what I'm doing is putting weight on a strip of paper to see how much load it can take and how long it how much it extends by before failure 
right now I have 300 grams on and there seems to be no movement as you can see guys the fracture happened near the clamping device which caused the material to fail but there was no elongation within the two measuring points so now I will be testing the high quality plastic carrier bag and to see how much the material expands or where it fractures from and that's how the setup will be there you have the clamping device and that's where the weights are going to be added so guys the strip of plastic has failed and it failed at the stress point on the G clamp on the beam the total weight you could take was 2000 grams and thank you guys for watching my experiment see you soon